thirdly, for the prediction of obstructive CAD by QCA, as measured by the chorus cat score, was significant predictor in the multivariate analysis, while at least in this analysis, calcium score was not. So now we are looking at uh, the chorus cat score, looking at calcium scoring. When we did this in a univariate fashion, uh, both of these tests significantly predicted the presence of obstructive coronary disease as defined by QCA. When we then put these into a multivariate model, in the multivariate model, chorus CAD did retain statistical significance, whereas the calcium score did not in this patient cohort. Again, shown that it does have significant um, value in predicting this disease. And finally, when we uh, looked at the predictive value of yes or no obstructive disease by QCA, you can see that while each of the tests, chorus, cat, and calcium score, were independently predictive of obstructive disease, the combination of these two tests was significantly better than either of the components by themselves, showing that a combination testing, as generally is seen, was better. And this is, uh, was looked at the patient in the patients who had both the chorus, cat score, and calcium score available.